boy. <clears throat> Rahu Bad Hotel. What up, everybody? I know in the suit here. I'm black at it, like a crack at it. Let's talk about it. Go ahead and introduce yourself, sir. Yo, you know who it is. Steven Josie, the one and only unknown Pharaoh. And I got something special for you guys today. I got another commitment video. And in this video, we're going to tell you the reason we're taking on this task to do a total of three books a month read and one audio book. But before we jump into that, let's get into the importance of reading, why we all need to read more. Uh, number one reason for me is to acquire the knowledge, as it should be for you guys. At a certain age, you're probably not reading books on, or not saying you shouldn't, but you're probably, probably, not, reading all. You, you're probably not reading at all. But if you are reading, you're probably reading books on entertainment, things like that. Um, however, we need to inform ourselves. We need to gather information, study great men, study great topics, study his history so we don't repeat it. On top of that, without us reading and gathering knowledge from other prominent black figures in our culture, um, we're not passing information on to anybody else. So that's the main reason we have to start reading more is to acquire the knowledge so we can pass it on to others, make people smarter. So yeah, that's 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 pretty much the bulk of it. But again, we all we warriors here we develop ourselves to become warriors. So let me tell you why warriors should be reading in the first place. So you don't you guys ever see those uh, those big mostly guys with no brains? We don't want to be those dudes. You guys watch the videos, we talk, you see me working out, you see how I eat, all that good stuff. We gotta have this as well. The thing is, we're not gonna win this fight over our brute strength. Like first of all, too many races hate us on on general. You know what I mean, uh, including ourselves. And so the muscles is not going to be the, the main reason why we're going to win this battle. The thing is, uh, it's going to be smarts. Learning how to uh, separate right from wrong. Knowing to uh, separate what is the African way and what is the warrior way compared to the rest of the uh, the Western uh, the Western world. Sorry. So um, this is why we're going to be reading. So I'm going to be reading in one second. So uh, I'm going to be reading three books as well. So my first book is going to be about uh, health. Uh, there's a way of doing it that we've been doing wrong for a long time. It's now getting brought to the surface. Uh, uh, learning about health, meaning like the African way, meaning learning how to use herbs, uh, things that we don't do now. We tend to go to the, uh, we tend to go to the pharmaceutical drug. If you guys see, oh, you guys not follow my, if you guys didn't follow my Instagram video, uh, please watch that one. But we're going to a pharmacy. Anybody know what pharmacy is? It's pharmacia. And what pharmacia, pharmacia means is uh, sorcery. So you're going there to these, uh, these Rite Aids to get pretty much placebo pills that don't really help out. It more of hinders you. It's, it's, it's more of a temporary fix and not actually fixing the problem. The African way is learning how to actually eradicate the issue. Um, so that's going to be the first book. My second book is going to be about history. Black history to be exact. But I'm, history plays along with every culture. But uh, it's going to be about black history, learning learning about the Dongo tribe. Well, keep, keep in mind, black history in relation to um, how we acted previously in Africa. Facts. Yeah. Exactly. Um, then my last one is going to be about wealth. Uh, again, I can't buy no missiles right now. You know, if I have to go to war, I ain't got the money to equip all y'all for it. So we got to learn how to get this money. So yeah, go ahead. Break it down. Oh, and the audio book. Oh, yeah. yeah. Audiobook. Last one, at least I forgot. Audio book. So we're, uh, the other book uh, we're going to be reading is uh, inspirational uh, books or uh, inf inspirational uh, audios. The reason why we're going to do that is because uh, I travel to work. I'm actually in traffic about an hour and a half a day. Um, so there's a lot of times I'm either doing nothing, listening to music, or uh, not doing enough, anything productive for an hour and a half. So uh, the books I'm going to be reading will be something that's motivational, something to keep me going. As I'm driving to work, I need something in my head that says, kill this day, go sell some training, train five more people. Or when I'm at home, what I want to just kick up my feet. I want something that I read to be in the back of my head that resonates with me that says, get up and do more things and work towards your business and all that. All right. Uh, that's pretty much it. Now back to me. Back yeah, to talk me. To him. Talk Star to him. the show. So this is what I'm going to be reading. I'm going to be reading uh, three books a month, just like Matthew. One on real estate, one on Black history, and different than what Matthew reads. I want. I'm more interested in the leaders we had in America, the black the black leaders of our people, at least from uh, from an American perspective. Um, so, like I said, real estate. Black history, I'm going to read a book on math or some sort of skill building. What are you doing on real estate? Uh, because um, I am a firm believer that the easiest way, potentially the easiest way to spread wealth amongst your family is by buying some sort of land, some sort of property, because with that, um, you can pass it on to generation to generation. You can't pass on your job. Um, you 
it, it may not even be the best thing just to pass on just money to your to your heirs. Reason being is because uh, money is uh, dropping in value every single day. You got inflation, things such like that. Um, but the moral of the story is that's why I'm going to look into real estate because um, it's something you can pass on through generations and generations and possibly build um, long lasting wealth. And for the third one, it'll be math or some other skill building. Like I'm not the best at math, you know. I do enough to get by, but considering that I'm gonna, I'm gonna school too. Yep, and considering I'm gonna be um, putting my toe in within real estate, I'm gonna have, especially multifamily, I'm gonna have to be able to calculate the cap rates and uh, things such like that, the foreclosure, or the mortgages, things like that. I'm gonna have to get better with numbers than I already am, um, or skill building. Like as of right now, I'm reading a book on um, how to read better and apply more critical thinking skills. Because as much as I'm, if I'm going to be reading so much, you know what I'm saying? I need to know how to do it really, really well. Facts. Um, but another thing. Um, oh, I forgot. And um, me off. a video, sorry about <laughs> A video or an audio book on motivation because you need something to keep you going or you're going to get depressed and stop and, you know what I mean? You're going you're gonna, to you're gonna lose it. So uh, one thing I, I, every time I purchase books, I try to find something on YouTube about it. Nobody's reading the books that I'm choosing. This is why the good thing about us reading these uh, three books a month, we're going to be able to give you guys book reviews. Because I, I know there's people out there just like us that pick up a book and be like, I wonder what smells felt, uh, felt about that book. You know what I mean? And then nothing's there. So then you're stuck with possibly purchasing a shitty book. So let us do let us do it for a Google 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 so you guys ain't got to go through it. Anything else? Yeah, not to mention, um, it's going to allow us to provide more content for you. You know what I'm saying? Because we're going to be, let's see, between the two of us, we got... We're gonna do we're gonna be doing reviews each week on a total of six books a month. You know what I mean? On top of that, I'm gonna do my best to um give you guys my journal. And if you don't know what my journal is, Watch make sure you video. look make sure you look at my um how to read books properly video. Um it'll tell you and I wanna try to share my journal with you guys so you guys get the cliff notes of all the you know the bangers we're gonna be reading every single month. Thanks. Yep. So anyway, with that being said, don't forget to comment, subscribe, tell everybody about it. The movement's going pretty damn good right now. I'm out. All right, that was, that's not that bad. Oh, she wasn't recording now.